He came back too soon. Get your ass out of here. Goldberg! Oh! Scott Hall tribute, let's go! With the Outlaw's Edge! Goldberg is stunned, so he should be right for the eliminating. We need to hurry up. Mustafa at 27. Another one of Rollins's cronies. Let's go. Here you crony. And you failed. Tell your boss I'm coming for his belt. I'm coming for that strap. Cesaro at 28. Let's go. And see ya. We almost done. Let's go. This feels more like a gauntlet match. Has been eliminated. Shinsuke. Let's do this. And only one more after him. Later. Let's go. One more. Let's go. Shinsuke Nakamura has been eliminated. The Miz. Let's go. Let's go, Miz. You and me have have some history. We're going to WrestleMania. Let's go. Yep, we going to WrestleMania, baby. There will be no suspense or waiting to find out who I will face at WrestleMania. Rollins, I'm coming for you and your WWE Championship. With that announcement out of the way, here's another one. There will be a huge match on Raw to determine who will choose the WrestleMania WWE Championship match stipulation. It will be JV taking on Seth's Disciples in a one-on-three match, of course. Mandate. Thought Seth had you... Thought said had you in his pocket, but now it's official. Doesn't matter. I'll win this too. What are you talking about? I had nothing to do with this. Just another random coincidence. Remember? Oh yeah, then what's with the wiki eye emoji? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, whoa. It's WrestleMania. Fighting to survive. Pump it up. Pump it up. Pump it up. Alright, hopefully we can end this quick. Oh yeah, Murphy. We gon' we gonna hurt your arms. We gonna try to even the odds here for me. Yes, down the red health. Let's see if we can stretch him. Oh, come here. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. Now, about that stretching. I'm 
gonna keep going for it. I'm gonna keep going for it. Let's go. All right, I'm gonna injure another limb then. Every time y'all come in here to help him, I'm gonna injure another limb. Shot after shot. And this is on your heads. Told you you gonna tap. We're going to Mania on my terms. This Mania match is going to happen on my terms. Like I said, Rollins, I'll overcome whatever you throw at me, Fax. And that includes the GM. Anything she can, anything she can to help your chances. Now, about that WrestleMania stipulation. Isn't there anything else you can do, Mandy Rose? You know this is for the greater good. I'm sorry, per WWE management, the outcome of the three-on-one match is binding. Fine, pick the match type, JV. It really doesn't matter what it is. We all know there's no possible way you can beat me. We'll see about that. Uh, normal match, Hell in a Cell, Extreme Rules. Decisions, decisions. You and me, no outside involvement from your disciples. Hell in a cell. Make it happen, Mandy Rose. There will be an official contract signing next week on Raw. On second thought, our WrestleMania match isn't going to happen. Meet me in the parking lot next week before the contract signing. We'll settle things right there. Oh, it'll still happen. But that sounds fun. I'll be there. Yeah, there ain't no weaseling out of this. Mr. Monday Night Messiah. Yeah, right. <laughs> and of course he's going to get to jump on me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, you jabron. Oh, on the concrete, come on. Come on now. Woo. Fall away. Oh, on the end of the other table. Go to the tallest ladder and climb with the catwalk. Well, which one's the tallest ladder? Is it this one? Oh, is this that scene from the My Rice trailer? Oh yeah, this is that scene. There's not going to be a WrestleMania match. Throw him off. Do it. End his career. Did he say throw him off? This is bad. He's doing everything he can to resist. No, no, no. I'll do it myself. Grab a hold of him. Oh snap! <clears throat> nope. See ya. So much for your disciples. Now they are the cripples. I'm Unless just you want to end up like your disciples, you're gonna sign the contract now. Remember who's next to the edge, Rollins. If I really want to, I can kick your ass over the edge right now. See, that was fun. I'll see you at WrestleMania. The WWE Championship match at WrestleMania is official. Yeah, I'm assuming Seth can make it off that ledge. Hey. Help! You're just going to leave me like this? Sure. Seriously. Uh, come on. Somebody. Dude, the ladder's right Somebody next to you. Me. Stop being a whiner. You can't just leave me here. The ladder's right there, right next to you. Breaking due to various injuries sustained in the parking lot altercation between JV and Rollins, Murphy, Ali, and Austin Theory will be out of action indefinitely. <laughs> Let's go. No more obstacles, no more disciples, nowhere left to run, and no place to hide, Rollins. WrestleMania, let's get it. I may not have backup at WrestleMania, but I don't need it. 
to beat you. The disciples served their purpose for the greater good. Now it's up to the Messiah to deliver the final blow. Yeah, good luck with that. So nice to see a normal Hell in the Cell rather than the, the red Hell in the Cell. <clears throat> Introducing the challenger from San Jose, California. Weighing in at 267 pounds. The outlaw, Jason J. V. Yo, we in my neck of the woods, man. That looks like Levi Stadium. <clears throat> from Davenport, Iowa. Weighing in at 217 pounds. He is the WWE Champion, Seth Rollins. Yo, we are back at the same place where Rollins cashed in his money in the bank on Roman Reigns and Brock Lesnar. That's what it's all about. The WWE hmm. I say this is poetic justice. Bring the cell down. Let's go. So you didn't need to bring it down that hard, man. That's damn. And you gonna get out of my ring. There we go. Like he was nothing. Come on, dude, climb. <clears throat> Come on, keep climbing. Let's see if we can toss Rollins off the cell. Oh, let's go, let's go. <clears throat> to the table. Yes. And... You can't jump off. Come on, Rollins. Oh, he might be too scared to climb back up. Come on, dude. Let's go. Ah, uh, he wants me to come down. Now he's coming back down here, guys. Come on, dude. There we go. Come on, Rollins. I want to see if we can drop him to the other table. Come on, baby boy. Come on! Throw him off! Yes! To the other table, nice! Yes, he's coming back up, let's go! No! No! Through the cell. Oh. Through the cell. Through the cell. Damn. Come on. Through the cell. Oh, there he goes. And it's over. Brass ring reach achievement. Let's go. Oh yeah, there we go. The new WWE champion. Let's go. Or should I say champion?
And we did it in Levi Stadium, baby. Let's go. Road to WrestleMania story is complete. So we got Chase the Rib. It says, holy cow, my old training partner is WWE Champion. Congrats. Hey, thanks, brother. Appreciate that. WWE. And your new WWE. Her new WWE Champion. JV. WrestleMania. Let's go. Say, hey, kid, I was watching Raw. The other night and thought that 24 7 title was kind of cool you should go after it uh hey coach it's been a while i thought i thought about it but not sure it's best for my career it's a little goofy so coming from mma maybe you need a little goofy every now and then uh might be good to show another side of your personality just my two cents works for that r truth guy Maybe you're right. I could bring some legitimacy to the 24-7 championship too. Yeah, or have fun with it, but your call. Gotta win it first though. Don't worry, truth will never see me coming. We're going after the 24-7 title, baby. We about to be JV3 belts. It's stressful always being on high alert. Never know who's going to come after me and my title. But this really helps. Oh yeah, that's it. Keep going, right there. Hey girl. hey girl, don't worry about it, okay? I, I got it from here, okay? Yeah. Take a break. Damn, I guess the reviews were right. You do have strong hands. Okay, easy now. Time to flip over onto your back now. Hey, what the hell? <laughs> Come on, ref. Hey, it's called the 24-7 title for a reason. Come here, my guy. Oh, through the table. <laughs> Let's go. You get up how I want you to. Now. Eat that steel. Truth nope. That. Boom, face first. Where's that shovel? We're going to bury him shovel style. No. I said we want to bury him shovel style. There we go. Oh. oh. And he said you're not uh -uh. going to do that this time. I'll get him every time. Let's go. Contact. Driven through the ground. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Hooked up. Oh. DT on the concrete. Stunner. Quickly into the cover with the title on the line. My ref. New champion. One, two. Three. I'm surprised I got the three. Yes. New champ. Yeah, um. Seriously? I didn't even get one minute to celebrate. Come on, bruh. It's a 24-7 belt. What do you expect? Right. Enjoy your 24-7 championship you reign while you can. All right, get back here. Big win over our truth champ. Thanks. You're not mad I beat your friend? If I got mad every time he lost a 24-7 championship, I'd be a very angry person. <laughs> Good point. I actually wanted to ask a favor. I'm always looking to improve my in-ring skills, and since you seem to be on a roll, would you watch my next match and let me know what you think? Yeah, sure. No problem. Thanks. And there you see the 24-7 champion checking out Carmella's match. Looks like he's seen enough. Wait, our truth is behind. Oh, you want some truth? Let's go. Hey, 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 hey. Truth. It's vital. You need to calm your damn a rose. Do a table. Ugh. Through the table again. Let's go. He's got 
hundred feet. And you're gonna eat the salad steel. And booyah! And we're gonna go for it. Wow, ref. Cover. One, two, three. Well, yeah. This one is over. Twenty-four-seven story complete. So I guess we keep the twenty-four-seven title, which makes me JV two belt. Let's go. That's kind of a quick one. I think we have time for another one. I should have known. Those hands were freakishly strong enough. Were, freak, were freakishly strong even for a massage professional. Uh huh. Hey, Carmella, if that was all just a setup so your buddy R Truth can sneak attack me, it didn't work. Still 24 7 champion. What are you talking about? I had no idea he was going to do that. Okay. To show my true intentions, dinner. Dinner's on me anytime. Ooh, we about to have a date with Carmella. Let's go. So our truth can show up in disguise as the waiter and attack me. No thanks. Bruh! Bruh! How you gonna turn down a date with Carmella, man? Let's go. Heard you wanted to talk to me about an idea you had. What is it? <clears throat> yeah, I was a huge fan of WCW. True. Uh, but unlike ECW, it's never had a... One big final send-off. Also true. Uh, so I was thinking it would be cool to have a reunion show before it's too late. I feel you. But I think the... But I think that ship might have... But I think the ship might have already sailed on that like years ago. I thought about it and I think it could still work if it happens soon. If you want to do all, all the legwork on this, then go for it. And if somehow you can get it all set up, then I'll bring the old WCW question mark attire out of retirement. Deal? Deal? Let's do this. Deal. Get ready for One Night Nitro. I'll believe it when I see it, but good luck. One Night Nitro. This is the one I was really looking forward to because i seen only one uh, person in the community play it, although I didn't see how it, fin how it ended. Hey, did you get my text? I did, and the voicemails, and the DMs. I was almost expecting a handwritten letter to show up in the mail. If that would help greenlight the WCW reunion show, then I'd do it. Look, I heard you already have Rey Mysterio on board, and obviously he can still go. But what about the other former WCW guys who aren't really active anymore? Okay, so what if I bring in another former WCW star and have a match against them on Raw to prove to you this can work? Okay, fine. I'll be watching. But if I'm not impressed then, then it's off. No more texts, DMs, or letters. Deal? I promise, you won't be disappointed. I'm not gonna lie, I do miss WCW, and I wish they would um, convert NXT into like WCW, make WCW like their premier startup brand. Oh, we fighting X-Pac? Yo, we fighting Pac, let's go. I don't think so, kid. Huh? See what I did there? Nope. Nope, not today, kid. Let's go. And we're going to wear this kid down. I have an X-Pac action figure still in box, man. I would love to meet dude so I can get it grafted. That would be dope. Oh, onto a spine. woo Nope. Eat that spear. Thank ya. Woo! Aw, oh, that went over his head, literally. Eat that knee, thank ya. No, dude. Oh, well, uh, well, we missed that too. Ain't that some shit? 
Nope. Punk. Punk X Punk. Let's go. Rock bottom. <clears throat> Here is your winner, the outlaw, Jason J. V. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. This is so what did you think? Uh, can we make One Night Nitro a reality? Still have my concerns, but based on what I saw, I'm willing to give it a shot. Yes, Raw is... Yes, Raw is where the big boys play. Uh, when you calm down, when you calm down, start reaching out to former WCW stars and see who you can round up for a big announcement for next for next week on Raw. Got it. Thanks. Don't thank me. Just make this work. This should be very interesting. Dude, that's dope. All week long. You've heard about a huge announcement I'd be making tonight. And now the time has finally come. You might be able to guess what it is based on the men who are gathered in this ring and those giant steel letters. But let's make it official. In the very near future, there's going to be a special one-night tribute show to the men and women of World Championship Wrestling. And it's going to be called WCW One Night Nitro. That's right. Raw is now where the big boys play. <laughs> I just want to say, it's truly an honor to be a part of helping put all of this together. And I can't wait to pay tribute to the legends in this ring and many more who influenced my career. <clears throat> now, with that being said, I'd like to... Huge news the oh, WCW boy. has something to say about it. Whatever it is, it must be urgent. Sorry to crash the big party, but I just wanted to say I'd love to be a part of this reunion show too. Apparently you forgot I spent a few months in WCW before it went out of business. Okay, key word there being months. Ended. I was actually planning on reaching out to you. Just wanted to make sure we save room on the card for some of the more well-known WCW stars. Well-known, well huh? But I'm sure we can work this out. Let's talk more later, all right? Yeah, sounds good. I'll let you get back to it. As you can see, this show is so big that everyone wants to be a part of it. Now stay tuned to the WCW hotline. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> stay tuned to social media for more information on WCW One Night Nitro. We never thought we'd see this moment. WCW will return for one night only. <clears throat> Oh, I think, I think Kevin Nash tore, tore a quad. Oh, there goes Ray Ray. Okay, maybe this will be a fair fight. Yes, not. Dude, it ain't my fault you was only in WCW for a few months while these other guys were there for years. Yo, watch out, man. There's people behind there. Disgraceful act to close out an all around shameful night for AJ Styles. <clears throat> all right, let's see what we got going on here. Uh, 
due to the attack on Raw by AJ Styles, several WCW legends suffer minor to serious injuries. As a result, Mandy Rose has made a decision to cancel the WCW One Night Nitro event. Hmm. She probably has something to do with that. Uh, AJ Styles, you destroyed what was going to be a special, a special night honoring WCW legends. But now I will honor them by destroying you. Face me in the wing, in the wing, in the ring, one on one, no sneak attacks. Ah, uh, upset I ruined your little super fan old timer show. I'll have an answer for you next Raw. All week long, I've been getting messages on social media. Why, AJ? Why did you take out the WCW legends? Why did you ruin one night Nitro? Well, here's the answer. At first, I was slightly offended I wasn't considered for the show. After all, like I said, I was an actual wrestler there. Unlike the super fan wannabe putting it all together, who never stepped foot in a WCW ring. More on him in a second. But then the more I thought about it, I didn't want to be a part of bringing back and honoring the egotistical, greedy dinosaurs who slept walked through their matches just to collect a fat paycheck, putting the company out of business, and nearly killing my career before it ever got started. In fact, it was so bad down there, when they first offered me a contract, I turned it down and took a job delivering water because it paid more. Because all these so-called legends were flying around in private jets with their guaranteed contracts, wrestling four times a year, and there was no money left to pay guys who actually wanted to be there. Ultimately, I ended up going to WCW for three months, and it was way worse than I thought it would be. Every decision from the top guys was made to hold back the younger, more talented wrestlers like me. Finally, it all caught up to them and the company folded. I had to go back to the Indies and work my butt off to make it to where I am today. But I'm the exception. Most of the younger WCW guys from that era, like my old tag team partner, they never made it. So that's how I remember WCW. Not as this company that beat WWE for a short time or part of this over glorified golden era of wrestling but a sinking ship that almost took down AJ Styles with it. So that's why I did what I did. I shut down the embarrassing tribute show before it ever happened, and I'd do it again 500 times. So let's circle back to the guy who started all this. You were just a fan when all that with WCW went down. You had no idea what really happened. But in my eyes, that almost makes you worse than the so-called legends you put on a pedestal. You're supposedly a WWE superstar now, so act like it. This isn't your time to play fantasy WCW. It's embarrassing. So you want to talk about destroying me for what I did? Remember, WCW already tried that, and they failed. So I'm going to do a favor for every man and woman in that locker room who has any actual respect for what we do, and destroy you. <laughs> Challenge accepted. Damn, that felt like a freaking shoot interview. Like, tell us how you really feel, AJ. And here's where we lose. Is he attempting a Styles Clash? It's Finn Balor. What's he doing here? It seems Balor's attempting to help out his former club partner. He certainly got everyone's attention. Oh yeah, me and Balor, we got history too. Don't think I forgot about 2K19. Oh, Nash. Oh, he's going to betray me. That was obvious. NWO, Bullet Club, you know, yeah. What exactly is the relationship between these three? I'm not sure if Balor and Styles 
Styles even now. Yep. Click. There's your answer. It looks like we've just witnessed the birth of some kind of new NWO slash club type alliance. This is bad news for WWE. Oh, I agree. Nothing good can come from this. Let's see. The attack by AJ Styles was a wake up call. Reached out to him after and we cleared the air wanted to make up for some what so he wanted to make up for some of the things aj aj mentioned about wcw's downfall plus what aj did is exactly what nwo would have done aj and balor are the new outsiders oh hell no i'm passing the torch to them too sweet for life uh this man gets it and is a true legend. Oh, and thanks for the assist, Big Kev. Too sweet. Uh, you're welcome, but don't think you really needed it. Guys, can I just say one thing? New Outsiders for life. Too sweet. You're going to pay, all of you. Oh, no. Too scared. Laughing, crying eyed emoji. You want a shot at us, JV? Then see if... One of your WCW buddies is still kicking and the new outsiders will gladly take you on. I gotta see this in person, popcorn emoji. <laughs> uh, the challenge has been made. JV, need, need a decision on who you will team against the new outsiders on WWE Raw. Let's see, Booker T... If I choose X-Pac, there's a good chance he'll turn on me and join up with, with the NWO because he was a member of the NWO. There's Ray Ray. There's Goldberg. Booker T is also a former NWO member, although he didn't join until NWO came to WWE. So it's between Ray Ray and Goldberg. Who do I want to choose? Let's go with Ray Ray. I'm dialing 619 for my partner, Ray Mysterio at Ray Mysterio and when we win I want another shot at AJ Styles done mandate there will be no rematch right Finn Balor no chance new outsiders yeah I'll make sure of that I mean I'll just be watching at ringside pay no attention to the big Kevin in the corner oh we paying attention we keeping our eyes open I always miss it. I've been missing a lot with the spear. I don't get why. That's right. Get wrecked, bitch. Nope. I said get wrecked, bitch. Tagging up with Ray Ray because he's one of my peoples. You know what I'm saying? Let's go. Another stunner. Bam. Good night. What a stunner. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Uh oh. Look at this. Oh, that was right. You guys are so cute. Uh oh, I think AJ got upset because he just ate a move that another outsider, original outsider that is, had. Punk ass off me. That's it. That's it. We we injuring a limb. We we working a limb. Ain't no style clashes for you. How you like my nail? Oh, come on now. Come on now. Nope, no sell. Come on, dude. Really? Why can't I hit that spear? Uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Uh-uh, uh-uh. You coming with me to meet my peoples. Get out of the way, ref. What the hell? Oh, fuck, 
fucking ref. I think that's an NWO ref. He trying to be the next Nick Patrick. Ready, Ray, Ray? Let's do this. Um, Ray Ray? That kind of didn't make any sense. That's what you did there. That's fine. We can go for a submission. Right, Ray, Jim, Ray, we got this. J.V. and Ray Mysterio making their case for one of the best teams around with that win. For my money, these two just might be the best. <clears throat> See, I got my rematch, but let's make things interesting. AJ Styles, you. Damn it. I hate when these freaking message threads do that. You always need a faction in your career to succeed. The club, the OC, and now this poor man's NWO. <laughs> Bruh. Strongly disagree, but what's your point? That's fine. You can disagree all you want. Uh, let's see if you can actually win a match on your own. You and me in a steel cage. Don't do it, AJ. Not worth it. Yeah, of course, because he's going to lose. Yeah, he's just jealous. No one ever wanted him to join a faction. Agree with Finn. Not worth it. You hear that, AJ? Your boys are pretty much saying they don't think you can get the job done without their help. Not what we said. Liar. Um, I've heard enough. I don't need anyone but myself to take you down, JV. You want a cage match? You got it. Sorry, boys, but I'm handling this one. Message received. Dot, dot, dot. Hmm... It's official. JV and AJ Styles will settle their issues in a steel cage. Don't miss this history-making clash. And I see what you did there with the clash. There we go. We nailed the spirit that time. Your punk ass up. And we throw him into the steel cage. That's right, AJ. Get wrecked. Powerless position to be in right now. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Long dart. <laughs> Rocking him and socking him. Eat defeat. Eat the knee. <laughs> Let's go. to the pond baby let's go we got a sig we got a sig
for life, baby. Let's do this. The Outlaw's Edge. And he's stunned. I think we're good to go. Oh, win by pinfall or submission. What the hell was I thinking? I thought we had to climb out. Here is your winner, the outlaw, Jason J. V. No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was his. All right, so one night nitro story complete, and I think this will be a good stopping point for this video. That was a very long story. So, yeah, y'all, really hope y'all enjoyed this one as much as I did. My bad for the sound interruption. I had to go take care of something. And so, uh, yeah. But anyway, uh, it's your boy, Jason JV, reminding y'all to, of course, don't forget to like, comment, and, of course, subscribe if you're feeling the vibes. You know what I'm saying? If you're digging what we're doing over here. And, uh, yeah, don't forget to check out, of course, all the links in the video description down below. That will be greatly appreciated. And, uh, yeah, till the next one, y'all have a blessed one. Peace.